Hello Cocos, welcome back to my channel. I am so happy you are here. I hope you get all the inspiration to get whatever you need to get done today to prepare for the week ahead. I am going to be cleaning out my fridge. It is a total disaster. So I'm gonna just stop avoiding it and tackle it. There's a lot of stuff that I can probably get rid of and I'm only going to make recipes based on the food that I have. I'm able to do this because sometimes when I go to Aldi or I go to Costco or whatever, I get stuff that are either on sale or that I feel like is a really good price that I can just keep in the freezer. And once those kind of accumulate, I get to a point where I'm like, okay, I could do a full meal prep with this stuff. So this is including a bunch of frozen organic vegetables, ground beef so we'll probably be using that today settle in if you have a fridge that has been neglected for a little bit maybe you'll get some inspiration and let's just get started okay so Ricky is here he's going to start making some soup while I clean so let me just show you the soup that we're gonna be making the plan here cut up the onion and garlic use some high quality butter put it in the Dutch oven and just cook those till they're about translucent and then he's gonna start chopping the carrots the celery some potatoes throw all that in the Dutch oven add the broth, add any spices, and then he'll cut up the chicken. We'll put it all in there and it will saute for 30 minutes. Okay, here is everything that I took out of the fridge that I'm probably going to keep or condense or consolidate. Um, this is all the stuff that I'm going to pour out and recycle and then I did have to throw out a few things. And then the fridge is looking pretty disgusting. So I'm going to just scrub it and make it nice and pretty and then We'll put everything back in. I got the door as best as I could, so we'll probably just leave that.
okay much better here that was really rough and I'm really happy that I'm doing this shelves clean the drawers clean it already feels so much better and now we're just gonna organize the food
Okay, so I'm making Kaiser's food because he has intense allergies and we have yet to find a food that works for him. So here it goes. This is what we're gonna try. We'll probably start mixing it with his dry food, but this is literally all organic and I'm just gonna add up all the calories and see how it goes. So this is from leftover from the zucchini boats, like the middle of the zucchinis. I did two things of ground beef. I bought all of this and froze it for when I was gonna do it. I think I got these from Aldi. And then just keeping it super easy, I put these frozen packets in. So I did a spinach one, two butternut squash, sweet potatoes. So I'm just gonna add up all the calories to make sure he's eating enough. Um, I also cut up carrots. So far, this was really easy to make and put together because I didn't have to chop anything. My goal was to just make food that we already had. This came in a pack of three. I'm gonna use the extra one. I have these frozen sweet potato, I have broccoli, I have fresh spinach in there. So we're gonna do the cast iron and just combine it all together and do a big stir fry. Okay, this is looking really good. You can season this however you want. If it like starts getting mushy, like butternut squash doesn't always hold up the greatest. That's okay, it's gonna taste the same. I'm gonna do um, coconut aminos, which is something similar to soy sauce, a little bit sweeter. And But if you have soy sauce, you can do that. It's gonna be amazing. Okay, that is a wrap for today's video. I hope you got all the inspiration to either clean out your fridge or meal prep or just even use the ingredients that you already have in your home. I hope to see you next week. Don't forget, I run three live workouts every single week. We do these on Tuesdays and Thursdays at 6.30 p.m. and on Saturdays at 10 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. Come to a Coach Core class. I would honestly love to have you. Your first class is free and I hope to see you there. Bye.